Thank you. Our procedure this morning is as follows. Each of the cardinals will speak one or two lines, and then we will open it to questions. I would just say that in the address our Holy Father gave this morning, that there's something he said that, that I think really rings true in, for all of us, and that is that he compliments our Holy Father for leaving as his legacy a church that is more courageous, a church that is more free, and a church that is younger. Uh, back home and throughout our country and the world, indeed, uh, people have prayed that God would send us a shepherd who would shepherd his people. And uh, those prayers, I believe, are answered. And as is always the case, uh, the Lord uh, gives us uh, an answer to these prayers, but he also sustains us with his grace. So I look forward to working with our Holy Father in, in promoting the, uh, the agenda that he puts forward. I look forward to working with him as he shepherds the church, and I pray that all our people uh, will, uh, will embrace him with love and affection and uh, will support him in his <coughs> ministry. Cardinal George. 26 years ago, when Karl Votiwa was chosen to be the successor of Peter, some of the most difficult challenges to the church's mission came from the East. 26 years later, the most difficult challenges to the church's mission come from the West. And there is a man now very well prepared who understands Western society and the history of the world and the place of the church within it to be the successor of Peter. Sometimes uh, I think in covering uh, events and people uh, in order to create something clear, a certain aspect of someone's personality or single dimension is chosen. And while true, if it's isolated, it can become a caricature. Who is uh, Joseph Ratzinger? I'd say two things that were told me in the last couple of months. One was by a friend from France, a layman, who I spoke to yesterday, who said, you have chosen a humble genius. And the second one is a phrase that comes back to me from an encounter I had at the Congregation of the Doctrine of the Faith with a woman who was part of the cleaning staff there. And uh, speaking of Cardinal Ratzinger, she said, Louis and Vero Cristiano, this is a true Christian. Hello, one, two, three. You may have to push something. 